Welcome everyone, myself Nanda Kumar and my batchmates Karthikeyn and Sridhar. So our project is design and comparative analysis of a new model wheel rim for four-wheeler guided by Mr. S.K. Nagurwali, Assistant Professor. We have done our project in Wheels India Limited, located in Pari, was established in 1960 is promoted by TV's group was started in the early 60s to manufacture automobile wheels. Today, Wheels India has grown as a leading manufacturer of steel wheels for cars, util vehicles, trucks, buses, etc. And that's a glimpse about the company. So let me go into the product now. Abstract, it's just a thin line of our project. And as you all know, the car wheel is the most important thing for low carrying element, even when the vehicles are in static and running condition. We have considered all load acting on the vehicle and natural vehicle drives. In our project, design and comparative analysis of new model wheel rim for four wheeler is to implement a new model wheel for saving material consumption in same efficiency of vehicle. Here, our project new model wheel rim is kind of spiral type wheel rim. First we have modeled the wheel using CATIA software and then the analysis part using ANSYS software. Our project has considered IX35 Hyundai car wheel for more effective analysis. This project is to test the wheel according to the specifications given by industrial standards. We have come to the interaction part. The importance of wheel and tires in automobile is obvious. Without the engine, the car may be towed, but even that is not possible without the wheels. And here is some requirements of automobile wheels. I'll read now. It should be balanced both statically as well as dynamically. It should be light as possible so that the unsprung weight is least. It should be possible to remove or mark the wheel easily. Its material should not deteriorate with weathering and age. In the case the material is susceptible to corrosion, it must be given suitable protective treatment. It must be strong enough to perform the above functions. And here you see the diagram of a wheel. And this is how a wheel rim looks when the tires and tubes are ripped off. And uh, this is the rim planche and inboard bead seat and rim or surface and here you just bolt your nuts and screw it up and we have done some literature reviews and here you find some types of wheels and there are three types of wheels basically and this is got from intent source and the first type is press steel disc wheel and second is wire wheel and the third one is light alloy cast wheel and you see a diagram of disc wheel let me tell you a one line about the disc wheel a disc wheel looks to be a sturdy type wheel rim used in heavy vehicles and it is stronger as you can see it And let me go to the next type of wheel now. And what you see here is a wire wheel rim. And you got to see plenty of spokes arranged in crisscross manner around the center of the wheel. And these spokes obviously takes up attention given by the vehicle. And this is about the wire wheel rim. And ne next comes is the forged wheel. And this is a diagram of forged wheel and it's a kind of simple wheel rim and you see basically in today's four wheeler vehicles and it is also used in racing cars for racing and it looks to be sturdy and that is about uh, the forged wheel. Objective. The objective of this project is to test the wheel according to specifications given by the industrial standards. 
and two kinds of test is being performed in the industry and those are bending endurance test second one is radial endurance test and that is about the objective of our project it is a detailed view of the spiral wheel rim and we see lots of dimension all over reason for we selecting the spiral profile it is for desired performance avoids overheating due to braking system spiral system owns momentum helps it to overcome the friction transmitted to the bearing and it is best suited for city roads advantages of spiral wheel rim the spiral flexure acts as a shock absorber preventing rocks and debris from interfering with driving and steering actuators makes the wheel stronger unique shape bears the loading continuously from inside to outside preventing it from riding upon its outside edge it acts like a paddle wheel to provide safety and capability it is more flexible this is the existing wheel rim which we tried out in carrier software and we have put this in ansys for analysis purpose This is the meshed part of the existing wheel rim. This is the existing wheel rim and it is being analyzed using ANSYS software. And this is our proposed spiral wheel rim. And we have done this using CATIA software. And we have put this in ANSYS for further analysis. And we have done some literature reviews and here you find some types of wheels and finally we have done with our analysis of our proposed wheel rim using ANSYS 15.0 and this is it it is the detailed view of the spiral wheel rim and we see lots of dimension all over and that is all about the formulas Conclusion The molding and analysis for the wheel rim is carried out successfully and satisfactorily. The wheel is analyzed for the following two load conditions one is bending endurance test, and another one is radial endurance test. In radial endurance test, three conditions are checked one is pressure loading, second one is vertical loading, and the last is centrifugal loading. We thank Wheels India for giving us a great opportunity to work there and thanks for the people who have been a great support throughout our project.